Hey, what's going on you guys? This is Hyperion Blue GT. Welcome back to the full walkthrough in the Crew 2. So before I'm about to get started, but looks like I got everything to be participate in the third episode of Live Extreme Series. But don't worry, I'll be continuing on for having some more motocross events. But this one is going to be a lot of good important events going on for today. So it's time to get ready to go down over to Los Angeles. But this is going to be a lot of good awesome time out there for taking the first leg of Jet Sprint. Going on to the port for the second leg by using motocross. And for the third and last, going fast as a professional racer will be going Sprint onto the touring car. But this is going to be a lot of good excellent opportunity for having three liveries in different discipline classes. So I'll be using with any kind of UTRS in Sportech livery design I made it for myself. So let's get prepared for having a good competition spotlight. It's time for some of those California dreams to come true, as proven racers and ambitious newcomers battle it out in the third stop of the Live Extreme Series. It's non-stop action like you've never seen it before. Okay, Jet Sprint, here we go. Let's do this. Let's win the race. The Jet Sprint boats sipping their way through twisty passages? We've got that too. Do you like supercars on the streets of Los Angeles? Have we got something for you. So now I have already been taking the lead for first place. Now it's time to get ready to defend my rightful position. Just gonna have to keep going in to have a good jet sprint cornering. Just gonna have that U turn coming in towards the checkpoint. Gonna take that left, increase that speed. Okay, gets a little bit more steady control. Now coming in at the marina. Decisive move. They're going for it. Time for some pure speed there. And those cruise ship passengers are getting quite the view. And that's how we have spectators, ladies and gentlemen. Just gonna have to keep going. This one might get a lot of good excitement by taking some good jumps. And here comes the final stretch of the first leg. Now coming in onto leg number two. next looks like we're not in the third course anymore folks time to go on for a time for motocross but this is gonna get a lot of extreme stunts out there better expect a lot here comes the leap of faith are you kidding me from a boat to a roof and from a roof to the ground now there's a leap of faith for you nice that was pretty awesome and extreme. And now over the river and onto a port full of containers. Those guys have no fear. I'm just getting started out for having a nice time. Better expect with some good bouncing focus. Slide it in onto the right. Going in onto the left. Come on, just gonna have to keep going. There we go, just take that good position here. They're gunning it as they head toward the home stretch of this section. Yeah, that's more like it. Well, at least so close, but that was a pretty good stunt. Come on, just gonna keep going. I can still got this one, folks. Gonna take that shortcut. Final stretch for the second leg, and I'll be ready to use my Corvette C6 to be ready. 
For the final leg, let's go all out. It's not every day you get to see these kind of cars going full throttle along the L.A. River. Viewers, remember, you can vote on social media to tell us who, according to you, is the driver of drivers in this year's Live Extreme Series. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, you guys. Every race always just meant to be going in for the start. Just gonna have to keep going. But this is going to get a lot of obstacles to be coming around in the L.A. River. And here comes the ramp. This will be going right back onto the road. This race is going to be awesome. Having touring car for the final leg is going to be a lot of good professional racing skills just like taking part on the racing circuit. Just going to have to keep going straight. Next corner on the way. That's the ticket. Who it's needs the last Apex? Of this race. A very this is going to be good. Drivers must keep their focus. Okay, time for a little hill climb. Gonna have to keep going in. Only 10% to go. I hope I'm going to win this time, folks, but this is going to be a lot of good sprint run for taking three legs. Only 5% to go. One more checkpoint, and here comes the finish line. Hey oh, first place. From now Southern that's California, awesome. This was the third race in the live extreme series. We're mid-season, and plenty of racers are making a case for why they should be crowned head of the series. So keep following us and your favorite drivers. We'll see you at race number four. Wow, that was a good, impressive six minutes and ten second run. But that was so pretty awesome out there, folks. Almost there, it's reaching up towards Icon 1, so this will be getting starting out. That was so impressive, but I still get the hang of it by using the jet sprint for the first leg. But this will might take a lot of good swooping skills to be on the water. And even for the second leg, that was definitely might be quite very good for some extreme stunts by using motocross. A good thing on the tarmac, but this will might have a good circuit skill experience for taking a lot of good mobility balance for a two-wheel drive. And for the dirt leg, pretty good impressive for taking on for some sprint runs, but it was definitely might be quite doing great out there. Without having Apex to be in the dirt episode, but this is definitely might be quite very good to get used to it by having a good pretending effort onto the driving line. And also for the dirt leg, touring car will be going on for the streets because taking on for the LA River is going to be a lot of good run to be on the tarmac. But this is definitely might have to take two lanes when entered across the river. But this is definitely might be pretty good to be going on to participate in the next episode. Now, time to continue on for having a motocross event to be at Mount Washington in the East Coast. But good thing I'm just putting up a new clip by changing a different outfit. So I hope this will might have to go in. And evenly for having a recommend performance will be needed as well. But good thing that my KTM 450 EXC Kapalik might need some upgrade. But the green mark check will be doing the right answer. 
So let's just gonna go in and travel to and get myself prepared for having a good motocross race. I see Tucker's here. That neck bearded beatnik doesn't know when to quit. He just doesn't get it. He may be the champ, but we're the future. Well, I bet this is gonna be a pretty good run out there. See that Tucker Morgan is ready to compete. So let's get prepared and get myself ready and this is going to be a lot of extreme challenge but this is going to be a lot of terrain to be going in by the uphill and the downhill. Come on, just going to keep going at it. This one is going to be very difficult. Okay, let's try to keep it a little bit self control. Come on. Gonna have to keep things up a notch. Man, this is so intense. You're falling behind, friend. Still trying, but this is gonna be pretty tough out there, folks. Come on. Gonna have to get myself to be in first place, but I'm at fourth. So it looks like Tucker is in the lead. So it looks like Roy is in first. Okay, final lap. I bet this is gonna get a little bit more risky. Come on, gonna have to take that jump. Okay, going uphill. There we go, just try to find the good rhythm to be going down on the motocross. Gee, this is gonna get a little bit more difficult out there. Come on. Just gonna have to take that inside overtake. There you go. I bet I could probably have to take a good response on the motorbike. Final stretch. I bet Tuck is going in to take home the podium. Man, that was so close, but Third place, we'll be having a check mark to be on the green. But that course is very intense. Maybe I could probably have to do some more practice on this course, but this is pretty tough out there. So I could probably have to take a lot of few jumps Taking downhill and uphill, but it gets a little bit crowded. But just gonna make sure to take exercise caution whenever you're about to participate again at Mount Washington for a different track course. Maybe this will might have to take a good look onto the map again. But I cannot believe it. But this one, this course is definitely might be pretty good. But it takes a lot of terrain. We'll be going uphill. We'll be reached up towards the top and go way down and up but this will might have to go down again but good thing i have already been made it for having a third place finish so this will might have a new difficulty will be unlocked gotta have to make sure to be ready to participate for the next event i bet this will might have to go for endurflix we'll be going in onto the mountain states just gonna have to travel and get myself prepared, but this is gonna get a little bit hard. Stay focused. Tuck is running this race. Now, I don't like him, but the man can ride. And if he's not ahead of you, he's right behind you. And he won't hand you the win. You'll have to fight for him. 
Well, hope I could probably have to fight for it. Taking first place is going to be a lot of focus. Just going to have to take a good steady balance. Let's do this. Show that Viking's boss. Okay, looks like this is going to have to take some extreme stunt jump. Going in onto the right. That part of the corner is going to get a little bit more extreme tricky. Gonna have to get my A game on. There you go. Just use that leg as the steam might have some good response. Okay, gonna have to take that right course. That's more like it. Make that good response on motocross racing. Just find a good rhythm. Solid good dirt scale. Just gonna have to take that slow jump onto that left side. Checkpoint clear. This one is gonna get a little bit harder. Just save that good amount of distance before taking on the next checkpoint. Okay, just get me back in first. You may have the top spot, you're just a wipeout away from the bottom. Final lap, folks. 50% is going in. Progression will be continued. There you go. Just keep that pace up and have that good left turn on the slide. That's the ticket. Take that good response as a motocross racer. Yeah. Here comes for the jump. Touch down and take that right corner. Almost there folks. This will might get a little bit more distance to go. Just gonna have to keep follow the line. Ten percent to go. Keep going. And here comes the final stretch towards the finish line. Yeah! Reach the finish line and have a nice good victory stunt. Now that's awesome! Okay, looks like this is going to be a perfect time out there. No has already come. Understand what we're about. You have to understand there's nothing like what we do. Mix the thrill of the ride with the thrill of getting way out there in the backcountry, and you've got something special. You need to feel it. Yeah. Well, I know you understand, Tug. I know you really understand the right thing to do. Well. I guess this is definitely might be pretty good and have a perfect moment for having a full segment, but snow day arrives and this is gonna be pretty good. Now let's just gonna have to check onto the light map again. Now that course layout is definitely might be pretty good with some fine hairpin corners. Just gonna have to be quite very good for having some motorbikes to be quite very good to be driving on the dirt course. Now let's just gonna have to check again. This one might have an icon one level required. So, 
I bet that's it for now. But I hope this will might have to get ready to go for the next part. I bet I could probably have to do some more freestyle events. But this will might be quite very good to get ready to get back onto the air. Alright folks, I hope you really enjoyed watching the race. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, bell for notification uploads and the links on the description down below if you want to see more. You can follow me on Instagram, DeepNetR and GT Planet whenever you want. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time to continue the journey in the Crew 2 and I'll see you guys later. Keep on racing, stay clean. <laughs>